Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance Fresh Save File Run. We are going to be going back in with the titular Isaac from the Binding of Isaac. Because, you know, we haven't unlocked any new characters, and you know what kind of is a new character? Isaac. We've unlocked the D6, which, in my opinion, makes him an extremely fun character. It's a simple item, as simple as changing other items if they are bad. Which... I don't know, it's a little thing, but it makes this one of, you know, my favorite characters, and I think a lot of people's favorite characters to play as. So I figure let's give it a go, because we need to go for an... What the hell is your movement pattern, dude? Uh, we need to beat the cathedral anyways with this character. Let's go for a reroll. Tech, shoot lasers instead of tears. Immediately. I'm gonna say that that's, uh, I'm gonna say that that's an upgrade. That sure, sure as hell seems like it. It's a tier upgrade for, like, tier is in T-I-R... Wait, ty <laughs> that's tire. Uh, T... <laughs> T-I-E-R, tier. Uh, it's a tire upgrade. I've been looking to upgrade my tires. Honestly, I should, but anyway. That's not... We're, we're not we're not getting there. I am... I We're off the rails already, but... Oh, boy. It's a good character, and getting that reroll immediately turning a speed upgrade into tech, which I just... The reason I said I don't know if it's a, a true upgrade is just because I know it's had some weird things in the past, but I think that those things are gone. Uh, that or just something about the item... I don't know. It's synergizing well with stuff and synergizing poorly with stuff. I think it's kind of the thing. But hey, I'm definitely into it. Probably should have grabbed that spirit heart later. I knew that was coming, and I'm going to get hit again. Yep. <laughs> That's exactly why I should have grabbed the Spirit Heart later. Dude. 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 I put myself in a position to get uh, my heart broken again. A little bit higher, and we would have gotten value out of that bomb. Speed down, slowly gain speed while in hostile rooms. At two speed, you become invincible. Do contact damage afterwards, lose the... I'm going to say no. Okay, well, it's certainly better than this. Should have taken it. I just remember not liking that item because I hate getting speed down. You know? But, hey. The dice giveth, the dice taketh away. But yeah, real shame about just grabbing that spirit heart and just punting it immediately. There was not a... I guess, you know what I could do? I could just hop in here. Unlikely that there's going to be a battery, but there... You know, who knows? Could be. Boop. Ooh. Bad gas. Health down. Oh, bo Okay, that's not the teleport worth doing. Yep. You know, game giveth, game taketh away. Got some good, some bad there. Pop a bomb. So we don't have knockback, which is a little, you know, theme of the day. A little bit of good, a little bit of bad. No knockback is sometimes helpful for enemies like this where knocking him back, you know, you could maybe put him in a corner. And that could be really helpful. Damage up. Does that give us a damage up? I do wonder. Sometimes you can kind of trap him in a corner, but also sometimes you knock him into yourself. It's a little bit of this. It's a little bit of that. Burning Basement. What do we got? Wait, what? Upon use, pushes enemies away and spawns a rock wave? It's not Butterbean? I mean, I'm not going to lose the D6 already, but... I do need to see what this does in action here. It seems good. The charge is a lot longer than normal Butterbean. Yeah, it's... Honestly, it seems legit. But I'm not gonna... Uh, I'm not gonna tap out on my first one. I'm immune to creep and floor spikes. That seems nice. I'm not gonna tap out on my first D6 run that early. Are you kidding me? Yeah, kidding me, Pam? We're not gonna do that. Oh god, those, there's no rock there! There's no rock there, there's just a rock man! Trying to see if I can do some tier jutsu, but this guy's pushing me around. 
Okay. Man, what a bad showing. I just got so excited I got complacent. Rock boys. Rock man. Alright, so we got our D6 charged up here. I think... At least we will after this room. I think we'll probably re-roll the... Uh, the I can't believe it's not the Butterbane. God, dude. Just, just beefing it left, right, and center. Chance to shoot a red fire that blocks shots and deals contact damage. God, though. All right. Just get your act together, man. It's going to be flies on the right, isn't there? Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. All righty. Not seeing any of those fires yet. There we go. I was going to say, hopefully that is a synergy that does work. All right. Come on, now. We're immune to creep and spikes. I'll have to I'll have to try and keep that in mind. There'll be times where we can definitely use that to our advantage, and I will forget. Ooh. That I'm telling you for sure already. So what makes this guy heat up? Getting hit? Oop. Make me a little bit mad too. Please, 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 let's go. We'll be fine now. Probably would have been fine anyways, but... We can even get, um... Oh, interesting. Should probably grab that after. A bomb for a key. Mm. We can even re-roll uh, the devil deal, is what I was going to say. I don't know what this guy's... Oh, he just does one supercharge? Okay, and then he does like a AoE. If he throws me off and he goes for some other kind of attack, I'm going to be a little upset. But we have the fire that's just completely making this fine. All right. Damage up, luck up. I mean, there's no reason to say no to that. We ain't re-rolling that. Alright, Guppy's Paw. Here's what we can do. We grab Guppy's Paw. Do we use Guppy's Paw once? I don't think so. But we put it back, we re-roll. We get Little Horn, so we got the Guppy's Chance. We take that. We grab nine lives. Die. No, don't die. Oh my god, man. That was just so good. And that right there is kind of like a big reason why I like Isaac, the character Isaac. Restock? Sure. Because, you know, you can just make some stupid stuff happen. I really should not have left some room explored. I'm going to bomb. I just can't justify uh, not doing that right now. Because if I lose that eternal heart, we don't get the health upgrade when we go down. To the next floor here. So yeah, I I made it risky when I did not need it to. But I'm like I'm jazzed about the possibilities of this run already. I think that they are going to be fantastic. Okay, I'm not going to sack my oh, way. Ain't nobody got time for this. No, man. Oh, boy. But I feel like I have to. Especially if we're not going for uh, boss rush. Which, I, are we sure we're not going for boss rush? Maybe we could. We have the thing on that makes, uh, makes it fair for those who care. So, like, if we teleport, it uses up some time. I've teleported quite a bit already, but... Like, also using the D6, it's it's an innately backtracking item. So. Your tears attract enemies and pickups. I'm not going to do that yet. Or ever. There's some runs for it. Maybe. Maybe tech doesn't work as bad with it as I, you know, would assume. Ooh. Is that the first time that's happened? I think it might be. Okay. 
range up chance of shooting petrifying tears. I'm going to say that that's absolutely good enough. All right. Run. Run. Cheese it. Like, should we just... God, my microphone is covering up half my freaking screen right now. Oh, God. I'm, I'm literally, like, dodging my head left and right to move around my microphone. One second. Jeez. Okay. All right. Pop that down. There was that bombable room. We got enough bombs to blow it up and blow up a crawl space uh, thing. Can't do anything with that. Ooh, black market? Bamba lamb? Choose between two items after beating a boss. Sure. Uh, the sack, school bag, hold two active items. Sure. Spawn some batteries, fully recharge your active item. Sure. Let's die. Get, you know, we can take more items. It's kind of the nice thing. Two extra keys. Chest contain more pickups. I think that's good enough. I'll trade a life for that. And then we will reroll this. Entering a hostile room has a chance to spawn a charmed enemy. I'll trade a life for that. I should have definitely, like, played... I could have gone for more rerolls, and I could have played the other thing, but... I'd say nah. Uh, I think we're... I think we're going to go back. I don't think I want to leave yet. Probably not going to get a deal with the devil on the floor, but I feel like everything we just got there is good enough, right? Being able to hold a second active item, well... What was that? Well, we have the D6. Seems like a great call. Sure. We die, we die. Increase your lowest stat. I feel like that's just good enough. Gave me a bomb as well. Yeah, that was a, it was a speed up. Oh, this is damage. No, no. Or not. Yeah, the petrifying tears are legitimately fantastic. Lucky penny. Don't mind that one bit. Yeah, the, the like boss rush business, it's just done. I know we could have left the floor, but... If I wanted boss rush, I could just, like, zip out of there. Just didn't feel like it. Zibibble? Um. No. We really want to be backtracking in these. We can... Rip, rip. I don't think I can teleport from down here. And say absolute sayonara to a boss rush. Okay, we get another reroll. Where was the... I mean, do you, do you re-roll the shop? Is it worth it? It's probably not. The very health up. Okay, we definitely don't want to die on this, this health up run here. And since we're definitely not going for time, we can just go boop, 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 boop. A, a chance to get a deal. Oh. Okay. Thank you. We froze him. Oh! Okay. We can choose between the two. Damage range up. Uh, they can be controlled midair. I don't really know if that works. Oh my god, of course we know it works. We just did it. With the, uh... 
the other character with a Zazel. Do they both get charged up at the same time? That's, I guess that's my question. If they don't, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Okay, so we got kind of like... We kind of have marked now. A fat bat appears. It seems like there's a little bit of... Is there homing to it? It's like the reverse of homing. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, we've ruined our life. As easy as we uh, we made it good, we've ruined it. Why is it so curvy? Why would you do that to me? Oh, God. Oh, God. It was so... I was like... I thought it gave homing or something. Because it... I know it makes it purple. I thought it would give homing with this since it's like a little bit weird, but no. Why did I even come in here? Okay. We might be fine with this. like, if we hit an enemy, is it... Oh, God. I don't know. There's something good going on sometimes. That laser absolutely hit that guy. Speed up, damage up. Damage up, shot speed up. I'll take a damage up. I'm not going to re-roll the damage up ever. Mom's knife. Does that... What? Brimstone? Brimstone, mom's knife? What? That was... You would have assumed we re-rolled for that stuff. Okay. Woo! What have I done? And I love it. Yeah, I... 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 Yep. Yep. Yep, okay. Just, just an itty-bitty brimstone uh, mom's knife wombo combo. Can I get a spirit heart out of the one? The, please, please, spirit heart. No, 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 of course not. It's okay. I mean, I can't complain. <laughs> I, I can't complain. I have brimstone and mom's knife, and I fixed my problem at the same time. And I'm shooting out like a, a knife blast, which I'm assuming is the, uh, the brimstone element of it. And we have that kind of, like, the tech, which is the laser on the knife. I... I gotta remember to... Should we get out of here? I don't know that way. We... Oh, my lord. Chance to get destroyed when... And sp uh, when hit and spawn launch. Touching enemies petrifies them. It deals contact damage based on its coin counts. I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad at all. I just don't feel like it. Constantly deal 10% of your damage in the direction. Hitting an enemy with a tear has a chance to spawn a fly. If we get guppy, I feel like that could be good. I'm just going to tap out on that. 99 bombs. Never going to be mad at that. The luck on this run is bonkers. But again, it's one of those runs where you're like, dude, I don't need this much luck on this run. Can I trade some of it to a different run, please? All right. Uh, minus one charge needed for active items. Definitely care more about that. Surely it's possible. If you just run in. Yep.
Okay. Jeez, dude! It's just because, yeah, they, you know, that's balanced around the fact that you typically can't run over the spikes. But there we go. We've utilized it uh, as good as we probably needed to. Zoop. Like we just, I think we just leave at this point. Got the charge cards. I just want to at least get to the next floor. I don't remember what the question mark card does. Use your active item for free. That's fun. Just knife blast. Lol. Wider tiers, increased knockback. Ooh. Yeah, very much. Just Dude. That's so annoying. Incoming die, maybe? It's okay if I do. I have the extra life. That's what that's all been for. So that I can trade it like crazy. Judgment. Judgment. I mean, I don't... I don't see a reason to do it a different way here. moon I guess one spear heart would be lovely I don't need a lot and I don't even need it I just it would be really nice okay sir open up Loving it. All right. <laughs> oh, what a run. What a lovely run. Where'd my card go? Is it here? Yeah. I'll get the, uh, the curse. Now that we have a spirit heart. I just... I don't even... Yeah... I don't even understand half the interactions that are going on with this uh, this tier thing, but I do love it. Slows down enemies. Question mark. Spun rain and pick up. We'll pick it up. We'll get bookworm charge. And then we'll actually re-roll it. The bean. There's a battery around here. Grab that. Cool. Did not mean to do that. My damage went down. How will I survive? How will this run survive? Okay. Guess I'll just have to fire a flurry of, you know. It's another active item. Just keep taking it. Just don't want to accidentally use that. You poor sap. If I could get the key pieces, that'd be great. I know that you can, like, go... You can get them... If you sacrifice a lot of health. At, like, a sacrifice room. I don't know how logical I can really make that choice. Because I think it takes a full heart, doesn't it? We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. But I think it takes a full heart. And thus would be a parabolum. I realize I have a knife behind me. Do I... Do I have the... I have the Yes Mother synergy? I didn't even know that. Okay. I walked into that for no reason. the radius of friendly creep. Don't care. Yes, mother. Let's 
Let's do a little bit of donating. It's a very fortunate run. That, wow, it took everything we had and then exactly tapped out. Goopy? Retrovision. Health up. Don't mind that. Death card. Necronomicon appeared in the basement. That was a boss. Health up, luck up. Um, again, since... I don't mind the luck up because we have some, like, randomized effects that scale on luck. So I actually think that taking that with the goal of being more able to use, like, a sacrifice room to get the deals with the angel stuff that I'm not going to be getting otherwise, I think would be good. Okay. Similarly, we'll just, like... Whoa. You, you're good. You're, you're good, dude. Here it is. The amount of sacrifices you need to do are pretty high, so let, let me check. Okay, it's a full heart. It's a full heart. So we'll see. What's the point of that room? <laughs> Would you like to come through? No. This guy's watch out laser is messing me up. Something fierce. Also, hold on. Beep. Again, more health means more potential to uh, use that sacrifice room. Whoa. So I actually don't mind it. I do mind this guy. He kind of sucks. Bloop. Friendly fly appeared. No way! Chance for the room clear reward to be key. I mean, that's not bad, but like just the extra charges is probably the better call. I'll go in there when I have a reroll charged up, just in case. And even then, I don't know. Should I? Mystery egg has appeared in the basement. Entering a floor drains all your hearts. I re-rolled it into the same thing? I don't want to do that because of the reason I have already said. I want to be able to sack some health, you know? I'll consider coming back to re-roll that. This is Necropolis 2. Okay. Got money. If I go to the shop, there's a red heart. If there's a red heart, I could probably, like, purchase some more sacrifices. For three. That's on sale. Yeah, we're, we're basically buying sacrifices. I feel blessed. Current chest. Increase angel room chance. Perfect. Uh, Sacred heart, health up, damage multiplier up, damage up, tears down, shot speed up, full health, homing tears. Uh, yep. Because so we, we want the key piece. All right. Jeez. This run. Spawn Uriel. So that we can get another key piece. All right. We've done it. We're done. We've done it. Should we go to the... 
Oh, God, should I go to the dark room then? I feel like I should go to the dark room. This run is so strong, I can obviously beat that boss. This run is stupid. Now we're playing Binding of Isaac, baby. Sacred Heart, Brimstone, Mom's Knife. Unhinged. Okay. I think we'll be out of here. Overpriced as hell, but kind of don't care. We can check for secret, the super secret room. I just also similarly don't really care. We're obviously taking the negative. We can't take anything else. But yeah, I think on this run we have to go. We have to go, Mega Stan. We gotta. Oh, oh. I thought that those turned off. Unreal. Okay. Remember that brief little part where I ruined my run with the uh, <laughs> the eye of the occult or whatever it is? You remember that? You remember that? You remember that like thirty seconds that I thought that this run was maybe gonna be toast? Good times, good times. Okay. The fact that these have homing now as well, it's just so funny. It's just all so funny. Zamoon. Zamoon. Head of the keeper hitting an enemy with a tear has a chance to spawn a penny. I'm I'm sure. I guess I don't really need money anymore. Crazy thing is I'm still not even uh I'm not guppy. I think we bring our um a reroll to the hopeful deal with the devil. Open up. Okay. Sir. High priestess, emperor. We can get the emperor if we want. There's a boss. Lux, soul hearts. Whatever. All right. Forgot how expensive it was to take hits here. All right. What was this? Is this a this is a regular beggar? I guess let's get the flight. Pop back over here. The hanged. Use the flight <laughs> in that order for some reason. Cool. Didn't matter. The the flight. Whoops. Grab the card. We could. I mean, we ha when you have the uh, the D six and you're this strong, you basically j <laughs> you should just clear the rooms. Pretty fly. Feels stupid not to, you know. Track pickups. The fact that I don't have flight is what feels weird. Double your bombs. I'm not going to even bother picking that up. Beep. 
beep, 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 beep
Get bookworm. Honestly, st still charging up the D6. We'll, we'll take the Book of Shadows into a fight. Not that we're going to need it. Tears can shrink enemies. Love it, love it. Yoink. Uh, shoot tears diagonally, spectral tears. I'm not going to roll with that right now. It's probably fine, though. You know what? Let's ruin things. Do I shoot twice as many? I know I'm shooting them out sideways now. Uh, four tiers at once. Standing still for blank seconds makes you invincible. Shoot a large piercing spectral tier that does 10 times your damage, but while held, taking damage removes an extra two hearts of damage, breaks the cannon for floor. The extra damage can't kill Isaac. Self damage does not trigger the effect. I don't know, sure. <laughs> I don't know that it's better than my regular shots. The <laughs> it's stupid. It's so stupid. Okay, where are you? Respond to the blue baby on death. If I, hey, there you go. If I die, I die, I'm not, I'm not dead. All right. Bonk. Charge up. No, no victory lap. We'll take the luck up. And then now we go up here. I don't want to fire rate multipliers, the thing, but I guess I don't think it matters. None of it, I mean, none of it matters. Let's get the invincibility. Hello. Okay. Got some summons. I don't think I can deal damage to him right now. Oh, we broke the glass cannon. All right. I forgot about the... I, I would have cared more about the not getting hit part if I remembered the, uh, the actual, like, glass cannon element breaking. Okay. I don't remember this attack. I don't remember that attack at all. The tears. Uh, this attack, I, I more remember. We've done it! Oh, no. Alright. Alright, speed it up.
Dead Boy achieved. Crybaby. I've unlocked Apollyon. I rule backwards. Ultra hard. Well, there you go. And there's a Mega Stan kill right there. Boom. There's our first one. Uh, yeah, that went well. That, that, that went well. And we also unlocked Apollyon. We got an, ourselves a whole new character. I wasn't even planning on that today, but boy, I'm not upset about it. Uh, so as far as the regular, as far as characters we still need to unlock, there is Jacob, who we'll get to, is all I have to say about Jacob. And I'm not looking forward to it, I guess. I remember this character uh, makes me want to tear my hair out a bit, if I remember correctly. So we got the, we got Apollyon. We still have the Keeper. We still have the Lost. We still have the Forgotten. Well, left for last once more. Boy, uh, Keeper is, boy, that's a, he's, oh, he's a long ways off. Uh, you need to fill up your greed machine to 999 coins to unlock that character. So, <laughs> cool. Uh, we'll get to it. <laughs> The Lost, we need to do a little bit of a shenanigan. Um, and The Forgotten, we need to do a lot of shenanigans. Apollyon, hey, happy to have you, though. On top of the fact that, I mean, you know, spoilers, I guess, if you don't know, but in Repentance, um, literally, you know how there's all these characters? There's a lot of characters? Well, there's twice as many, actually, because every single one of them has, you know, an alternate version that we can unlock as we get into the later content, if we get into the later content. It's entirely up to how much you guys support this series, though. So let me know in the form of a comment down below if you'd be sad to see the series go. Thank you for watching. Check out the channel for Roguelikes and more every single day, and I will see you next time. Bye.